Good morning everybody, welcome to this week's celebration slides for our school community and wider community. This week we celebrate our children's successes as well as bring you information about our new parental questionnaire that has been issued to you, whether you choose to complete it online or via a paper copy. This hopes to capture your views from how school performed during the national lockdown that we saw in January to March. Your opinion really does matter to us, so please um, take part in this questionnaire and enter into the chance to win a £50 cash prize. Um, have a great weekend. Remember the clocks do go forward this weekend as we see the start of British summertime. Lighter days are well and truly on the way um, and I hope that is the case as we move out of this period of time that has again um, been very difficult for lots of us. Take care, have a great weekend, don't forget those clocks. See you on Monday. Bye bye. On Tuesday the 23rd of March this week we remembered all that has gone this year. It was a National Day of Reflection where we took a, a small amount of time to remember all those people that have been affected by the COVID-19 pandemic. It was also a time to remember the people that have been there to help us and the people that continue to be there to help us as we begin to move out of this very difficult time. I do believe as a school community, we are stronger together. By working together, it, it has allowed us to achieve so much, not only as a school, but as a wider community. Thank you to all of you for your ongoing support and your continued support for school. Um, but I do hope you remembered or took a little bit of time just out of your day to remember what has gone before and those that have gone before us. This week, you have been sent at home a questionnaire, a paper-based copy of a questionnaire we as a school have put together to capture your views and opinions. Uh, this is also available on our website um, and the banner at the top is the icon you need to look for um, that says Parent Carer Survey. Uh, your completion of this um, questionnaire automatically enters you into our prize draw to win £50 cash. Um, the deadline for completion of this is on Monday, Monday the 29th of March um, and you will then be entered into the prize draw and we will do this draw prior to us breaking up next Thursday. Thank you so much for your comments um, so far. I I've read every letter we've had so uh, far that we've had back. Um, and I can only say I've been humbled, touched and very much moved by what you have said about this school. As I've said to you in the past, it is a true privilege to serve you as a school community. Um, and I wholeheartedly believe that. And that has been strengthened, my opinion has been strengthened by the support, care um, and love that we've been shown by you as parents, carers and families. So just a huge thank you for your comments, a huge thank you for your feedback. We will reflect upon this and change our practice moving forward um, so that we can continue to offer the best for your children first and foremost, but also you as families. Thank you to all of you that supported Comic Relief at Wren's Nest. Um, children took part in our TT Rockstars Challenge um, and they had a, a wonderful time, not only learning their times tables and challenging each other, but raising money for Comic Relief during this process. Um, we have raised £125 uh, by buying Paul's very special Red Nose Day biscuits. So a huge thank you to all of you that have supported this wonderful charity. From the 29th of March to the 4th of April, it's Autism Awareness Weeks. Um, this is when, across the country, uh, charities that work with children who are diagnosed with autism come together to make people aware of the challenges and successes autism brings to many. As a school, we are also celebrating this um, and on our website you will see a banner with lots of different assemblies and stories read to explain what autism is, 
what we can do to support children with autism and just how they see the world. Um, take time if you can to have a look under the banner and just to explore a little bit more about children who do have um, an autistic spectrum disorder um, and how as a community we can continue to support them and also celebrate them. This week, enjoy Mrs. Gallus's Wellbeing Wednesday video, all about Ali Baba's Magic Cave. Go on a special adventure, take five minutes out of your busy day, and enjoy five minutes of relaxing and enjoying some special time for your well-being with Mrs. Gallus. Just a reminder for you, I did share this with the children in Friday's assembly. On Sunday, our clocks go forward as we see the beginning of British summertime. So just a reminder for you not to forget to put your clocks forward. And this sees the start of British summertime, but also brighter days ahead. As you know, we have been celebrating Readers of the Week at Wren's Nest. These are children that are trying really hard and achieving well within their reading. Whether that's learning a new sound in phonics or beginning to blend letters together to read words, or whether that's exploring a new genre to read for pleasure. We want to celebrate all of you. This is something that we are really passionate at about at Wren's Nest um, and we are supporting the children in school to work really hard on to achieve great results within literacy. Let's see who our readers of the week are this week. Now for our Mathematicians of the Week, let's see who they are in early years, Key Stage 1, and who are Rock Stars of the Week, who's been on TT Rock Stars um, in Key Stage 2, that's years 3, 4, 5 and 6. Excellent news this week for 1S. You have won Attendance of the Week, so excellent attendance for you. Um, you know as a school, attendance is a real priority for us because we believe if children are in school every day, they can maximise their learning opportunities. A huge well done to 1S and well done to you who have attended school this week um, every day because you are maximising learning opportunities and becoming even better than you already are. To support communication during the lockdown period, for those of you working at home, we created the email addresses for each of the year groups um, at school. These are still available. So please, if you need to speak to your teacher, you want to drop them an email, whether that's to ask them about something that you've done in school or whether you want to ask them about homework they've set you, or you just want to tell them about something wonderful that you've done, why not drop them an email? Um, they'd love to hear from you. As always, please stay connected, pass on any information you receive to people that you know who don't receive it um, and Parent Hub and the school website are the best places to go to access the most up-to-date information. If you do have any questions or queries, big or small, please get in touch with us. Lots and lots of ways now for both families and children to get in touch with us. Um, a number of uh, ways to contact us here, but there are also the WhatsApp groups um, for work. Um, and also, if you need to drop off any work in school, um, you can do that through the post box or you can email us, as I've said before. Have a great weekend. Remember those clocks. Uh, brighter days are ahead. Uh, we see the last 
week of the spring term. A very strange term, this term. But we see the last week next week, breaking up on Thursday, the 1st of April, um, and returning to school on the 19th of April. But have a great weekend. I'll see you on Monday. We're here if you need us. Take care.